Hey gang, AV here, and uh, welcome to my 500 subscriber contest. Oh, wow. Um, 500. You know, uh, I think it was back in March when I first uh, took off so that I could concentrate on doing some grown-up stuff in the real world. You guys know the whole story by now, so I'm not going to go over that too much. But um, it was either February or March when I took off from YouTube, and I had just broken 400 subscribers then. And I, I said, you know what, I owe you guys a contest, but it's going to have to wait until I'm done. <coughs> Excuse me. It's going to have to wait until I'm done taking care of some stuff out here in the real world. And uh, I just came back recently, and I found that I had just broken 500 subscribers now. I don't know what the hell happened in the few months that I took off, but damn. <laughs> I gained 100 subscribers and I didn't do anything. So, I don't know what happened, but hey, thank you. Uh, you guys are awesome. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for watching my videos, leaving your comments, clicking the like button, sharing them on uh, your forums and whatnot. I really appreciate it, gang. That's awesome. Thank you very much. And to show my thanks, I'm hosting a contest. Now, this is going to be a special contest, not only because it's my 500 subscribers, but I've also got a sponsor this time around. Uh, the fine folks behind the book called Living Corpse, uh, you may have heard of it. If, if you watched a couple of my videos or uh, on my channel, I've mentioned it a few times. And um, a couple other guys on here, like Hippies Collectibles, for instance, he's a big fan of that book as well. Uh, I met three of the guys uh, behind the book, and uh, we got to talking, and sure enough, they were more than willing to offer up some prizes. They just started handing me stuff and say, here, 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 give this away. <laughs> so, that's awesome. Uh, and uh, be sure to check out the video description down below, uh, where you'll find contact information for all three of those guys, uh, their Facebook pages and whatnot. And uh, before we get into the actual prizes, though, uh, uh, a few things I like to talk about first. Uh, first of all, you've been staring at Venom while I'm a bit jabbering on. Uh, just because I know I'm going to get some questions about it, uh, that was the uh, front of my college portfolio back in the day. I drew that on there, and there's Spidey. He was the other half. Oh, focus. 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 There you go. Alright. Yeah. Uh, that was the other half. I just cut them apart recently and put them in frames. They're not the permanent frames, but I figured I put them in the background just because I am going to be jabbering before I actually show off any of the prize support. Give you guys something to look at. Uh, next up, uh, there are rules to this contest, and then I'm going to tell you what the contest entails. Uh, as in what I'm going to need you to do in order to enter. And then I'll get into the actual prizes. Uh, first of all, the rules. Uh, you've got to be a subscriber to my channel. Doesn't matter if you've been a subscriber since the very beginning or if you just subscribed now to enter the contest. Doesn't matter, as long as you're a subscriber. And I will be checking. Uh, <laughs> well, I'll try to check, but please subscribe. Um, <laughs> uh, anyhow, you've got to be 18 years or older. That's YouTube's policy, not mine. Um, and your entry has to be in the form of a video response. Now, uh, in order to do that, very easy. You just go down to the comment box down below, and uh, you click on it, and then an option will open up for you to you'll see like a link to click a video open a video response click on that follow the instructions and you're good to go your entry has to be a video response to this video I cannot guarantee that I will see it otherwise so you have to make sure that it's posted as a video response to this video and actually come back to this page and link it to this page okay um, 
Now, what your uh, video response has to be is this. Uh, tell me what your favorite toy is. Doesn't matter if it was your favorite when you were a kid. Doesn't matter if it's your favorite now. Doesn't matter if it was your favorite when you were a kid and you just happened to find another one, like last week. Doesn't matter if it's decorating your desk at work. Doesn't matter if it's proudly displayed in, in the middle of your man cave. Doesn't matter. Just tell me what your favorite toy is. And tell me why it's your favorite. If you've got it handy and you want to show it off in your video, even better. But, just tell me what it is. I, uh... I am very heavy into the comic book stuff right now on my YouTube channel, but I do have video game subscribers on here too. And uh, I just wanted to make this contest open for everybody, you know, and I figure that's a good way to do that. That's a good middle ground for everybody. Chances are, if you're watching my stuff, you're probably a geek like me and you probably got some toy laying around, so just show that off. Doesn't matter. And, uh,. All right, I've jabbered all long enough. Let's get into the prizes. The first prize packet, and there will be four prize packets, but only three winners. How does that work? Anyway, the first prize packet will be uh, the Living Corpse prize package, and the first item in it is Kirby Genesis, number one, put out by Dynamite. This was the sketch cover with an original sketch done by Ken Hazer. Very, very cool. Next up, we've got uh, two Living Corpse stickers. Very, very cool. All right. Next up, we've got, uh, and this, these are very neat. Uh, there was an animated film for The Living Corpse, just in case you didn't know. It's out on DVD and it's out on Blu-ray. And uh, during the convention season, uh, the guys behind The Living Corpse had these little sketch cards that they were given out at the conventions, where they would do a sketch and then you could just insert it into the uh, jewel case for the DVD or Blu-ray, whatever it were. And they gave me three of them. And each person did a sketch for me. So you've got a uh, Buzz Hazen sketch there on the left. You've got a Ken Hazer sketch there on the right. And then you've got Blair Smith's. And last but not least, we've got the Living Corpse Haunted number one one shot. If I can pick it up. Come on. There we go. This came out a couple weeks ago, and this particular copy was signed by all three of the creators there. So you've got Blair Smith, you've got Buzz Hazen with a thumbnail sketch, very cool, and uh, Ken Hazer right there. All three on the same book with a sketch. That's awesome, gang. You can't get much better than that. And again, that those prizes were supplied by the guys behind the Living Corpse. I got to talking to them, they were kind enough to give me that stuff, and I said I'll give you guys a plug, and there we go. Now the, uh, the next prize pack is going to be the Guardians of the Galaxy prize package. I've only got maybe four or five Guardians of the Galaxy books to give away, but I wanted to beef up the stack a little bit, so I threw in a whole bunch of other books too. So. Starting things off, we've got the whoops, doo -doo -doo, the Amazing Spider-Man number six sixty six, prequel to Spider Island. We've got Ghost Rider Volume Two number fifteen, first print glow in the dark cover. Probably the coolest gimmick cover from the nineties, gang. Awesome. We've got Ghost Rider Volume 2, number 15 again. This is the gold second printing. And it's got the glow in the dark cover again. Very cool. We've got Action Comics, number 672.
We've got G.I. Joe, a real American hero, number 185. We've got Guardians of the Galaxy, number 54. All the Guardians books are from the tail end of the run, which is which makes them the harder ones to get, honestly. Guardians of the Galaxy number 55 with a ripjack. Guardians of the Galaxy number 57. Guardians of the Galaxy number 58. Guardians of the Galaxy number 62. Alright. Next up we've got the Avengers prize packet. Now, you guys know me, I'm a big Avengers fan. I not only buy up the books that I need, but I also buy books to upgrade the ones I've already got. For that reason, a couple of these are going to be uh, reader copies. I will point out the ones that are reader copies, though, so no worries there. But uh, they're definitely good to read, but might not be good to collect. Only that there's only two, maybe three at the most. So it's not that bad. But anyway, we've got Captain America 130. I mean, it's not an Avengers title, but it's Captain America. May as well be. We've got The Avengers, Volume 1, Number 13. First appearance of Count Nefaria. And if you look, it's not a bad copy. It's a solid mid-grade book. Not too bad at all. Unfortunately, I can't say the same for the next book. The next one is definitely a reader copy. It's number 87. It's the origin of the Black Panther. And you can tell that cover has seen better days. But it's still readable. Stick that down there. Next up we've got issue number 125 with Thanos. Very cool. And uh, the next one is a reader copy. It's issue number 130. And you can tell it's a little beat up. But again, it's a good read. Can't go wrong with Bronze Age Avengers. Then you've got the Avengers number 131, which was the next issue. Very cool. And we've got issue number 167 with the Guardians of the Galaxy again. I could have put this in the other lot, but nah. It's an Avengers book. It's going to be with the Avengers. And then last but not least, we've got the Avengers number 213. This was about near mint condition, I would say. And it is a key. Uh, it's kind of a morbid key. Not very popular key, but it's a key all the same. Uh, if you have ever wondered why Hank Pym needs to uh, redeem himself to the readers and the rest of the Avengers. Well, it happened in that book. And then there's one other prize packet. One other prize packet. And it's in this box. That is the mystery box. It's not DVDs. That's just what I had in there when I moved in. No, there's definitely comic book stuff in there. It's a mystery, though. I'm not going to tell you what's in there. I will just tell you this. It's comic book related. There are three items. And the combined retail cost of all three of those items 
is at least equal to any one of these prize packets right here. What's in there? Could be anything. It could be a boat, but it's not a boat. I promise. It's not a boat. It's comics. What comics? I don't know. And only the winner will find out. Now, here's what's going to happen. The deadline for this contest today is September 10th. So we'll make the, the deadline October 10th. Midnight Eastern Standard Time. Eastern Standard Time. I have to stop drinking before I make these videos. I have to. <laughs> I have to. Um, anyway. <laughs> Midnight Eastern Standard Time on October the 10th will be the deadline for your video response. You have to have your video response in by then. Maybe a day or two after that I will post another video announcing the winners. Um, the way I'm going to determine the winners is this. As I'm watching your videos, and I will be trying to watch them as they come in, as I watch your videos, I will copy down your username and assign you a number. When everything is said and done, I will take those numbers and those usernames and I'll head over to random.org and I'll use their number generator. I'll click the button and the top three numbers that come up randomly, because it is random.org, the top three numbers that come up will be the th top three winners. Uh, the first place winner will get his choice of any one of the prize packets you see before you. The second place winner will get to choose his choice of any of the three prize packets that are remaining. The third place winner will get to choose from the two prize packets that are remaining. And then whatever is left over after all that is said and done will go to the first place winner. I was kind of thinking about doing a consolation prize thing, but no, I think I'll make the grand prize winner win his choice and then whatever's left over. So that's the way it's going to work. All four of these prizes will be given away to three winners. All right, that should do it. I think I've covered everything. Um, this has been AV. Take care, gang, and good luck.